Hi, my name is Tara Gujadar, and I'm the co-director of the Traditional Arts and Ethnology Center. Today I want to talk about a little bit about the changes that a lot of the different ethnic groups in Laos and mainland Southeast Asia are undergoing. Our newest exhibition called Seeds of Culture, From Living Plants to Handicrafts, focuses on the Job's Tears seed and plant um, and how it's an indication of people's changing relationship with nature nowadays. Uh, here, I want to show you bags from the Jingpa as well as Gamu ethnic groups, uh, which demonstrate sort of uh, modernity and change. Uh, these two Jingpa bags are both uh, of the same structure. So the Jingpa, traditionally their bags, which they use for everyday um, life, um, would be shaped like this because they believed that the body of the bag represents the torso of the human, and the fringes down here represent the legs. You can see here along the fringe, they use the Job's Tears seeds, uh, long tube shapes, um, in order to form the legs. Uh, nowadays, when they don't have access to those Job's Tears anymore, they would just use plain white thread because they still need the symbol of those Job's Tears and that uh, element in order to form the legs of the body of this, this bag. Here, these are net bags from the Gamu ethnic group of Lao. Um, traditionally, these net bags would be slung over the forehead to carry firewood or non-timber forest products in um, from the fields. Um, it would be made and crocheted actually from a vine called the biet vine, uh, which would be found actually quite uh, widespreadly across uh, fields and villages. Um, people would have to harvest the vine though, uh, dry it, strip it, um, and to make the thread, which is quite time consuming. Nowadays, when people don't have the time or because of resettlement no longer have access to the Piet vine, they might just use a simple plastic thread, which they can buy in the market, but they can still uh, use, make the, the bag. Um, so this is an example of, many, of the many changes that a lot of these groups are going through and how this affects material culture. A lot of these ethnic groups are trying to hold on to um, the same semblance of their old lifestyles but are substituting newer materials um, in order to do so. To learn more about this and the Job's Tears, please visit us at TAC in Montalban. Thank you.